Hi guys, it's Mark from anypond.com, your trusted resource in the UK for ponds and water features. Today's video is how to install a water feature with fire. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be installing this trio of basalt columns with a trio of fire torches. It's all run on propane gas, so you don't need to be corgi registered. And we're going to go through the five steps of how we installed this feature. Stay tuned for the Any Pond Showcase. Hello guys, this is Kenny from Any Pond. We're here today with uh, Luke. He's the, the newest member of our team Any Pond. And this is a water basin 45. We're just digging now to put it nice and level. Mark out the basin area. And dig to the required depth level. Compact hole of base. Install and make sure it's level. So what we have here is uh, the fire and water three-piece basalt. They come pre-drilled lengthwise. So this is a torch implement. The gas comes up on the top of the nozzles and the water will come up on that outer sleeve. Make sure the grub screws are sticking out. Tape the gas and water pipes together and then you can connect the gas pipe to the fire torch and the water pipe to the water pipe connection. Make sure they are pushed on fully and tighten up. Feed the pipes through the column and legs to reduce damage to pipe work. Drilling a hole into basin have to be specific due to column location where you drill is where it goes. column into position. Thread the cables where will they go in the basin. So guys we installed also the other two columns as you can see. They're hooked up on the pump. Uh, we're just filling the aqua basin with water now. This is a splitter so the three torches are hooked up on this and this is the main line that comes from the gas bottle. It goes on this regulator here. You can adjust the fire like you want it, big or small. And then this line goes to our gas bottle. Test gas and water flow. You can adjust the water with the valves onto the pump and also the gas from the gas regulator. This is the splash curtain. We use that to retain as much uh, water as possible from the splashing uh, of the feature. This will be bigger than our aqua basin and leveled slightly facing towards the aqua basin. So any water that is splashing on the curtain will slide again back to the basin. Apply stone finish to the basin, pebble or gravel or shims to level the column. For maintenance, check for any water loss Make sure your splash curtain is working properly so the water is not going out of the splash curtain. So the maintenance for the propane gas bottle, you just need to check for any gas leaks and make sure you turn it off fully when you're not using it. I'm sure you agree this looks completely amazing. Water and fire, what else could you could possibly have? Now we're coming into the autumn months. Fire, I can feel this heat now. If you want any more information about water and fire, there's a couple of links in the description below. And also, you've probably seen, if you're a regular on the channel, we're trying some new edits. Tell us what you like, tell us what you don't like. We're looking for feedback. My name's Mark, the Pond Advisor, and I'm here to support you. Dream, plan, and enjoy ponds and water features. Until next time, I'll see you in another video.